Hello world champions, I'm John Ward and this is Breaking News with a John Ward Breaking News. Breaking News! Oh my god, there he is! Joe Biden! You know it's him because he's staring at small children in the same way the guy Rittenhouse shot stares at a job posting for Disney. Desperate for voters that are either alive or legal, Joe Biden made a quote-unquote spontaneous stop at a Sheets gas station in Pennsylvania, which as I'm sure you've already deduced, wasn't spontaneous so much as scripted to a T and backed by a mafia-esque or else. This is the big guy torching his worthless underlings. In this case, the Sheets family, spelled with an S rather than a Z, big time Democrat donors. So this is sort of like in The Departed or Ozark, a shakedown, aka an intimidation audit. The Sheets family, which is a very interesting faction in Pennsylvania, did not seem to be able to find the enthusiasm to cook up a quality piece of propaganda for the big guy. Instead, Biden wandered aimlessly through the store amidst best case reactions, total dismissal, and worst case, where he has to do that stupid vacant politician smile and pretend he, the entire room, and the millions of people watching can't hear his voter base telling him to his face in front of armed goons to go fuck himself. Yeah, thanks for nothing. Thanks for nothing. Fuck you. Fuck you. 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 Point of the story? Sheets made Joe Biden look like a literal retard, which isn't true. Biden made Biden look like a literal retard, but you know Biden and the left and how that mafia operates, so per the mafia bylaws, the hammer must come down on these insubordinate gas merchants. But that would be too obvious. I mean, surely write a transparent, publicly reported on mafia-style retaliation against an American business for not using the appropriate amount of suction on their Alzheimer's emperor. Even for Clown World, even for 2024. That would be straight up ridiculous. Sheets is being sued over its hiring practices. The U.S. Equal Employment Opportunity Commission filed the suit this morning. It claims that the way Sheets bases employment on criminal records disproportionately screens out black, Native American, and other multiracial applicants, and that this violates federal law. The suit does not accuse Sheets of being motivated by race when making hiring decisions. We have reached out to Sheets for comment, but so far, we have not heard back. That's it for today. If you like these videos, please like, share, and subscribe, and consider supporting this channel through Patreon, one-time donations, the merch store, original music, or John's new book, all of which can be done at johnwardcinematics.com. I'm John Ward, and until next time, remember, you're a world champion. Don't let your memes be dreams. Fucking shit, smoking timelines, lit all up.